So we just finished um, 750 Formula Race 2, um, coming up to 5 o'clock. So yeah, we're getting the last of the sun here at Fruxton. Lovely. It's been a good day for you, hasn't it? It's been a good day. That race was a little bit harder with uh, with two red flags, so we had to, we had to do the start twice, but uh, good result. Um, so yeah, not a bad day. And this, it, it was good. It said it was going to rain earlier in the week. It's beautiful now. Yeah, it's a great day for the, for the slick tyres. And uh, yeah, I know obviously in this series we've had a little bit of you know change of tyres um, in recent times. So yeah, tell us about you know the change. What impact has it had on the car? Yeah, so um, in theory they're they're similar, but in practice, like all things, they're a little bit different. So so uh, quite a lot wider, probably close to an inch wider, um, which has meant most of the most of the cars and been modified to fit that tyre but um, so far we're quite pleased with it versus the the tyre we had before we're on our second season with the same set so it's proven to be quite good value for money I've got no idea when it's going to stop working but we'll probably find out at some point well we'd like to congratulate you again on uh, on your second uh, win of the day um, and we're going to move on now to um, Dave Hopkin um, yeah second conversation we've had today obviously yes. your, your second podium so um much oh. simpler this time. Start at the front, stay at the front. Much simpler than, than start <laughs> at the back, get to, get to the front. Yeah. Well, I was going to say, you had a troublesome start in uh, when we caught up with you before, but better start this time. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, not quite as good as Dave's, annoyingly, but uh, good enough to hold me in second place. And then halfway around the opening lap, something in the rear suspension started flexing. And it was really quite, it was quite a wicked shimmy out in th through the fast corners. So I thought... Hmm, let's not be brave. Let's dial it back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we, uh, we, we heard you had a, a, a bit of a moment, a bit of a moment, sorry, out the back section. Um, did, did it catch you out on the first lap, that, that rear suspension sort of failure? Yes, it, it was uh, the effect of the lateral control on the back axle was broken. So as it got, it was all right actually in corners when it was loaded over to one side or the other. But as it actually got out to a relatively straight bit, it started fluttering. And that is not a nice feeling for the, for the back of the car to be moving without you asking it to. Well, UK's fastest circuit, you want, you want that rear end to be stable and, and some confidence in it. Absolutely, yes. So, very rapidly I thought, you know what, Dave's got this, Let, let's try and bring it home. And I was actually probably the most delighted person with the second red flag there is out there. <laughs> <laughs> well, well done again, you know, second podium, and I obviously, you know, you're going to be pleased with that at circuit like Fruxton today. Yeah, absolutely. First time I've ever been here, so learning the track in qualifying. Uh, so you, two seconds to the guy who owned the lap record even before we got here isn't, uh, you know, you can't sniff at that. Yeah, no, exactly that. Congratulations again. Thank you very much. So we'll, we'll move on to, uh, to third place and I think this is a bit of a, a surprising result for you, but y you tell us how it panned out, Jake. Um, well, we had a little bit of an incident on the first red flag start, but apart from that, can't keep up with these, so best of the rest and it was really good. The car felt really good compared to this morning. and. Yeah, that's about it really. Really, really happy with it. And you made some changes coming into this weekend? Um, well, we, we carried on, we persevered with it from Donington and it wasn't very good. And this morning it was still here and not really as good as we wanted it. So we went back to the old one and that race was back to how it was. Really good. And I understand um, a family member raced the car, the car that you're in today prior to yourself. Um, one of the longest races in 750 Motor Club. I understand as well, and, and the car's been passed down to you? Yeah, he's been doing it, I think, I think he's done it for 53 years, I think, continuously, and three years ago now he passed it on to me, and he's still doing all the setup and everything, so without him I wouldn't be here anyway, so. Keeping it in the family? Yeah, that's it. Well, congratulations on your third place. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that was the final race uh, today for 750 Formula, and we'll see them again soon.